If you're new here, my name is Tisha. So I work in a healthcare firm in an IT department. I'm a business systems analyst. And our work currently is a hybrid mode. So I have to go to work twice a week and then work from home rest of the days. My call just got canceled. So my 9.30 and 10 a.m. call got canceled. I didn't get a chance to get coffee earlier because I was running late. And now I get coffee, walk chape as well. Yeah, so basically my morning just cleared up which is great because I'm running behind on work. So I have to do estimate analysis, which I will be reviewing with my manager tomorrow. So I do have to wrap, wrap that up today. Otherwise, I didn't know how I would finish it today because after work, I'm meeting one of my good friends from college, Exella. So she's visiting Connecticut for a work training and we're meeting later today for dinner and drinks. So yeah, I was really thinking I would have to come back and log back again or wake up super early in the morning to finish it up so this is freaking awesome just two meetings being cancelled has brought me so much joy today morning so our elevator has been shaking for the past two weeks every time you stop on a floor so yeah chape is traumatized do you want to eat like asian food like a good salad 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 <laughs> what the f Let's sit outside. Let's find a place where we can sit outside. Hi, I would like to make a reservation for two for dinner. For so I end up getting spicy green pork with eggs and rice. Yes. Is there a screen sharing for me? So my meeting today. It was alright, but to be honest, it wasn't. It was whatever. <sighs> we got additional requests from the business. I was trying to pursue in a certain way and my persuasion skills are not that great. It's okay. It's just work. It's just work. And at the end, everything works out. It might be annoying and stressful for the time being, but everything works out at the end. Just gotta remind myself. Have a good time. My mood is so much better after dressing up. I swear, dressing up <laughs> always helps. It's like, a, hold on, I just saw a phrase in Instagram. Dressing up for dopamine. And that's what I'm doing right now. We're supposed to have dinner around Grand Central area, which we had a reservation for 6.30, but then both Excel and I, we are late. So now we're meeting in West Village instead. And Ashanti, if she's able to join after work, should join us as well. So it'll be like a small college reunion. Can't believe summer is almost over. And I don't think so I've told you guys. I'm actually going to Australia in three weeks. I think yeah, three weeks left now. And I'm just excited to see my sister, my nephews, um, her family, my mom, my dad, and be there for my mom. And that's the thing that gets me going right now is just see my mom and be there for her at a time like this. So I'm wearing this all white dress and for shoes, I paired it with this pink shoes. So I wanted to pair it with this pink bag. It will fit my essential, but not my camera. So switching up with this white bag. Otherwise, if I didn't have to carry my camera, I would have paired it with this bag and that way it matches with the shoes. Such a freaking beautiful day right now. Well, it was hot and humid earlier, but it has cooled down. It's such a nice summer day to walk around the city. I want to take a quick OOTD here since no one's here. I couldn't show the back earlier. The back is all open with a tie-up detail. 
No, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. I'm just taking OT. <laughs> we look so good. Hi. This is like so low. In my happy place. This is my happy place. Wine. After how many years? Four so, years? Four years. Yeah. Am I more beautiful? Yes. Yeah, so yes, you are. You look the same exactly. You have not even aged yeah, at all. Yeah, yeah. We used to go to college together. We used to party together back <laughs> in our prime. Well, it's prime days still, so prime, I don't want to say that. Years. Well, it's still prime years. Come on, 30 and thriving. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Don't you think like 30s are better than 20s? For sure. Yes. I completely I love agree my, with it. I love my 30s. Me too. For some reason, there's certain like certainness about things you do even though you're like you're nervous about it we started hanging out our sophomore year right freshman year i think we had different group circles yeah. but then it was mainly in sophomore well end of sophomore year yeah and then i think we got closer in junior and then senior year she used to make pasta for us always pasta with uh tuna <laughs> best pasta but so, it was nice eating all pasta without <laughs> getting away right yes right now we can't do Our that. metabolism is at a whole different level. No, we can't do that no more. No. no. So we're on our way to go. What bar are we heading? Rose. And then we're meeting the Shanti as well. Yes. It's a small reunion. Mm -hmm. Love you. Love you. Shanti, this whole get together was so impromptu. I just wish today was Friday night. Um, in that way, I don't have to wake up early for work. I actually have to go to work in person tomorrow, which I am not looking forward to it. I have so much energy right now that I can't go to bed. I got home at 1 and I think it's 1.30 right now. I'm so late. It's 8.45. I am so late. So I'm wearing this all pink outfit and for my shoes, I'm just wearing Nike Air Force. My feet are hurting so much from last night. I really need to stop wearing heels when I know I'll be walking around. Yeah, very simple and comfy. Oh, today for work today. And for my bag, I'm just carrying my regular massive work bag. Okay, bye guys. So work today wasn't too bad. I definitely had a hard time being focused though. I had to like force myself, really force myself. So today I continued with the analysis for the estimates. So touch base with business to discuss on the next steps, set up those meetings. It wasn't too bad. I was expecting today to be very, very hectic. I think one of the main reasons is because, so today there was a retirement party for one of the business owners that I used to work with like a couple of years ago. This was such an elaborated retirement party. They had appetizers, entree, desserts, and then coffee afterwards. And then after that, um, they had speeches and then photos. I've been to other retirement parties, but this one was at a whole different level. Since I took an unexpected long break, I do have to work tonight, but I'm so tired, so I'm debating to either do it tonight or just wake up early in the morning. I have a 9.30 meeting tomorrow, 
so I might just wake up <laughs> before that maybe um, wake up around 637 and then log in around 8 to start work and that way I can catch up on things oh and the meeting that I was upset about from yesterday at the end it seems like it might work out I have a follow-up meeting again on Monday for it sometimes I feel I just over magnify the situation in my head well I overthink a lot but sometimes I just have to realize that there are a lot of things that are out of my control I love having some sort of control and a lot of things in life I have to recognize it and be okay with it that a lot of things are out of my control and everything that's happening is working for me it's working on my behalf and I just have to trust the unknown like trust the universe that everything will work out at the end I woke up thinking about it even though I was so like tired and hungover and after work I was supposed to go to gym I don't think I've told you guys in the vlog but I've started going back to my um, strength training workouts my new physical therapist gave me the green light to go back but i'm not able to do all the workouts i can't even do like half of it everything is with modification but i'm just so happy to be back again even though it's just twice a week or once a week one thing my pd told me to avoid was valleys and peaks so just take it easy even when i'm there not to push myself super crazy high expectations but momo it's not good at all mm -hmm. So you think that you don't have to dress up yeah cool there's not really a realistic work days in my life because typically i don't go out on a weekday well i do go out but like a proper night out i do that on weekends not on weekday it just happened to be in this vlog um so it's definitely out of the norm this is not how my usual work days goes but yeah i really hope you guys enjoy coming along with me this weekend i had such an amazing no weekend weekday look my brain is already <laughs> on the weekend um i had an amazing time with Ixala and ashanti and just feeling very happy and grateful um i really hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you enjoyed the video don't forget to support the channel don't forget to check my instagram which is tisha shreshta and hope to see you guys in my next one bye you always have it all you always